Well, some frightening moments overnight after a 737 slides off the runway and into a river in Jacksonville. This morning, incredibly, we could report that aside from some minor injuries, everyone on board is okay and accounted for. 137 passengers and seven crew members were on that Boeing 737 when it skidded off the runway and into the St. John's River. That's at the Naval Air Station in Jacksonville. First responders say, yeah, this could have been a whole lot worse. I think it's a, it is a miracle. Uh, it could have ended very, we could be talking about a different story this evening. So I think there's a lot to say about, uh, you know, the professionalism of the folks that helped the passengers off the airplane. Um, there's a, a, a lot to say about, uh, about that because it very well could be worse. Well, the plane is a charter flight that brings military personnel, contractors and their family from the base at Guantanamo Bay twice a week. Alex Osaitis reports from outside the hospital where some of the injured were taken. Outside of Memorial Hospital, it was a much different look than late on Friday when several people were standing outside of the emergency room. All of them doctors, nurses, clearly marked in special vests. That was part of the mass response team out here at Memorial. We have learned that 21 people were transported during this situation. Four of them came to this campus, Memorial Hospital over on University. Now, we have learned that several of the people were also taken to area hospitals near Orange Park. Everyone in a good condition, some just taken to be checked out after that very uh, traumatic incident with that plane going into the water. Uh, this is what we know overnight. No major developments from the scene here at Memorial, but still staying on top of things. Reporting, I'm Alex Ositis. All right, and of course, as we do get new information here on 10 News, we'll be posting that online and in our free 10 News app.